Hello everyone, it's Guillaume Martin here, the author of two books on finding your purpose and now we're on the six of how to build a business around your purpose. So let's do like a, a little play here. So I have no idea what I'm going to write here. Uh, just think of a few ideas of a purpose. Uh, some idea, maybe ideas I've had before, an idea that we're, we're going to get together right here. Um, let's take somebody, uh, for example, let's say that they, they really like, um, they really like golfing, uh, they really like to be in nature, they really like, um, what do they like? They like uh, being surrounded by family, and they like entertaining people and they like barbecues now uh, what are they good at well they're really good at cooking they're really good at hosting um, they're really good at finances and they're really good at um, writing writing they love they love to do to write in their spare time they've been told that they're really good at it and what else they love um they're really good at chess now <laughs> no that's uh that's just a person that uh we work with and what now how can you use this to serve others well they love golf they love um they love to be outside uh, and they love hosting and they're good at it they're good at cooking now could they have some time of bed and breakfast where they bring people um, could they have golf could they um, could they be hosting parties related to golfers could they like have um, uh, what kind of business there's a lot of golfs going on uh, and it used to be more popular than it is now but one thing I learned from uh, doing a development is that a golf really really increases the value of the properties around it so even though maybe the golf is not pro um, is not like a, a good investment uh, per se as it's not returning that much revenue then there's might be ways to animate it and because uh, let's say the owner owns the properties around it, then it might produce a lot of income uh, from selling those properties. And then there's a lot of parties that can be done at the golf uh, and everything. So uh, golf is like for, for, for the beauty and the environment and then can also a lot of weddings and stuff like that. So let's do... Um, <laughs> So there's like a land where the person uh, with a golf, so there's a mini putt. <laughs> uh, so let's say there's land. How many acres do they need? Mm. I don't know, maybe for a golf. Uh, okay, let's say there's 200 acres, um, which should be enough for a golf. Now, what can be done there? Okay. So that person loves golf, like to entertain, so uh, now I put it very small because I was going to write around but it's kind of small. So there definitely needs to be a hotel there or like a, a, a reception center. So could it be a little conference center? Uh, that could be awesome. Like we see lots of golf with, that, with those. Uh, with a restaurant, so there's going to be a kitchen. So those are the ways to make... Um, uh, let's see the, the cash flow of the golf um, what needs to be there so there's the uh, the memberships memberships uh, there's the the restaurant so we'll call it food uh, where it can make income you can host, host receptions uh, so the, in conference receptions uh, oh what if you would do it differently and having people come uh, you know when they do like uh, seminars kind of stuff so you can have like a lot of seminars in your golf and then uh, let's say instead of charging um, 
let's say you have like Tony Robbins or the like come uh, and they do a reception and instead you partner with them so you give the room for free but then you charge a percentage of their sales so you can have uh, make a lot more money but then you take the risk of, uh, of not being paid up front so that's up to you there's multiple ways to uh, to charge and make deals with the people um, could you do little events like have music bands coming and stuff so uh, let's say entertainment oh. entertain uh, so you can have music you can have uh, magician shows you can have all that stuff uh, type of shows you can have like kind of a, a banquet style room maybe a buffet maybe maybe not uh, where people can come for the show so uh, hotel hotel uh, you can charge for rooms uh, actually you could build like little homes all around and rent those Airbnb style or managed by the hotel so uh, and that you can do with the lots around around your golf that have a lot of, um, of value um, what else like there's so many activities you can do there on your uh, uh, on your development and it all started because you like golf and you like to host so uh, cash flow get sponsors very good way to uh, to raise money right away uh, because you bring in a lot of people then people want to advertise their company put their logo uh, let's say in the hall and all that stuff so raise money for sponsors uh, you can have golf tournaments there so you want to you, you, you're, you're gonna have TV so how do you promote uh, promotion so your marketing your sales um, how you're gonna do that well you can have like a, a so sales team so there's people that work for you and sell but how are they going to do that um, so you can have TV like 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 competitions that come there uh, make events and you don't have you just know that you don't have to 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 do it yourself um, just become a partner so let, let's say there's a TV show that could come here like a you would see you have a mini putt on your lot and you bring uh, mini putt competitions and then like I don't know if the, the scene is that big on TV but um, you know whatever whatever show wants to come there and then you get the sponsors and the TV you partner with the TV and they create the stuff so that's something you can do what else uh, maybe you have a lake here so you want boat rides um, all that stuff so you, you can lease equipment uh, or give it to the members whatever uh, multiple ways to do that give discounts to the members of course and bring the public from outside so and that maybe you already had the golf and it was failing and now we're just going to animate it and make it more profitable or find a golf that failing and uh, buy it from them and then do it yourself or if you don't have cash well you might find the partners if you show them that or what you can do is partner with the owners of the golf say look I'm going to manage this uh, this is my plan to increase the revenues I can do it for you and um, that's it done <laughs> you just uh, own this project or your your uh, uh, do it as a joint venture or a partnership and then everything is good uh, so you promote sales TV events you're gonna have like traditional like website and flyers and all that stuff but it's not that good but you, you can do a lot of promotion uh, YouTube like have, have yourself or your crew uh, your salesperson or your employees promote it um, what if you would make a spa your uh, uh, in one part of the, the the resort so you turn this into a resort and well I guess those ideas come easily because we're making like a similar development uh, which is much bigger but then you, you turn it into a resort so which is awesome because now you're attracting all the money uh, all the people and all the money is brought from all around the world because now we're a resort so they have the golf available uh the little retreats uh oh that's one thing you can do is uh host 
retreats. Um, I have partners for this if you need, and um, and masterminds. So I love retreats and masterminds. So you can become the place that owes them. What else can you do? Well, there's so much. Uh, so you promoted it. Uh, cash flow. Now, who, who can you partner with? Well, as you said, you're going to partner uh, either with the owners, if it's an existing one, and they're for sales, uh, for sale, or they just want to increase their cash flow. Well, become their manager and do that for them, <laughs> or partner. And then who else? Uh, well, the sponsors, the TV, uh, get like notary or lawyer to, to work with you. Just give them a piece of the pie um, or, or just, uh, just pay them. Uh, what about the municipality? Like if you're going to make it, this all happen, you want to make sure that uh, that's what they want. So skip the red, the red tape by giving people what they desire. Uh, look at the market around what's needed, what's offered. Um, is there competitors in the area? Could you work with them? Or you want to improve on what they're doing, offer better service? Um, yesterday we went to Parc Omega in Quebec while coming back to Mont from Mont Tremblant. And uh, they have animals like a zoo, but you're on your car. It's a safari kind of. Uh, for the animals of Quebec um, and North America, it is amazing and was fun, and that's something you could have in your backyard uh, or not, because now it's becoming like a major, major, huge tourism project. Uh, <laughs> but there's nothing that you cannot do, uh, just from the, starting from a little piece of land. Then there's so many ideas that come to mind that you can do yourself. Um, so. You know where the money uh, is coming from, from your project. Uh, of course, there's going to be um, money from investors uh, at first or from the bank or whatever you, you wish. And then uh, you're going to give return to them or pay from, from the capital that's raised after. Give it back and then own the project. Um, or the partners are going to be cash partners from the owners. They're going to give the land in return for, for you to develop it. And uh, many, 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 many ways to approach this situation. Um, what else can we do? Um, promote cash flow partners. Um, well, there's all your marketing in there. So there's so much and this you can go so deep in uh you can write a book about uh about golf and then you become the like the person who wrote a book about it and people want to come see it uh get on tv get on radio uh just talk about your book so instead of like paying to promote then people want to uh to interview you because you wrote a book um you want to go to like real estate investors club and all that stuff talk about it and that's going to promote your project uh, to sell the memberships while well, you have your sales team you have the promo that you're running on social media um, like that can go really really deep and uh, for the money raising while well, you do it through partners uh, maybe bank and grants like that requires a lot of paperwork though and a lot of background check um, so that your personal um, uh, revenues and, and your uh, uh, your credit score will be taken into account um, let's see let's see compared to private investors that will invest more in the project than in you so um, so we know you love golf, we know you love hosting, now you got like a, a little resort on the golf, which is amazing. Um, we're actually doing something similar with partners, so that's super cool, um, that you can get involved if you want, if you want uh, see how it's done, or uh, get involved somehow in, the, in this chain. Uh, there's the builders as well, so maybe they want to partner with you to own a piece of the resort. Um, yeah. So it's that easy like once you accept uh, your ideas your 
your your your your you found your purpose through your passions and your skills and you brought this together and now the universe wants to help you to realize it so maybe that's why you saw this video today or maybe uh it's going to open your mind to all the possibilities of partnering with people and of making this happen and of creating something amazing to serve others that like uh that are passionate about the same thing you are and you're using your skills to bring it to them i not too sure if i'm forgetting something but this video has gone long enough you're awesome and i'll make some notes on other ideas ideas that come to mind surrounding this and surrounding what else do we need like like who do we need like um uh what about the bylaws what about the uh legalization um getting the the uh the approbations to do that uh what about the 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 law stuff what about the contracts that you need and all that stuff well then there's really people that you need to put on your list uh people that you need to contact to make this project happen and it's their expertise you let them do it and uh all you do uh well see you love golf and you love entertaining you might have just become a uh, golf developer <laughs> so thank you so much for listening today if you need help with a project like this or, or creating a business surrounding your purpose or you want to get involved in a in a, in a project like this well uh contact me i'll put a link to a uh, discovery call and we're going to talk and we're going to find something awesome for you to do to serve others and serve the planet and serve yourself and accept help with love and happiness in your life thank you so much you're awesome and i'm blessed to speak with you today